Okay. What's the deal with these? <clears throat> well. <laughs> America makes synthetic rubber. This kind, one of two principal types, is called Buna S. Mix the chemicals thoroughly. In 1960, we invented synthetic materials. The first thing we did was we put rubber soles, synthetic soles, on the shoes. Come on, boys and girls, and follow me. I'm Swifty Flyer. I just can't be beat in my PF Flyers, the shoes that winners choose. A big event happened. You know, I call it the Nike generation, the Adidas generation, the tennis shoes generation. We started wearing sneakers. Ninety-five percent of people walk insulated on the earth. So this most common sense thing that we are organisms that live and grow and depend entirely on the earth while we're alive and yet we have completely isolated ourselves from it. We're so disconnected that it becomes this weird thing if we actually slip our shoes off. You've heard it before, celebrities are just like us, or are they? Elle Fanning did something the other day that probably a lot of you may not do. The 18-year-old actress landed at LAX airport late one night, looked pretty comfortable, but it was what she wasn't wearing that was getting people's attention, and she walked barefoot throughout the airport. This was the single thing that happened that probably caused the proliferation of inflammation-related health disorders far and above anything else. Woo! This is the uh, most destructive invention that man ever made, the synthetic sole shoe. This is so incredible. This is Nobel Prize material. 